Enos. Yeah, that was really unfortunate. There was like... I fought a Horde Dragon that had a level 5 unit. Uh, it had an Angry on 3-1. I fought a Wonder Waddle that had like 3 upgraded units early. And there was like one other player that had something absurd. Yeah, it was just a kind of a curse lobby to begin with. I didn't get I didn't get punished for skipping my turn one shop and picking up the mouse on the next turn. Like I didn't get punished for that decision, but I think taking the gloves was a mistake. I just never got any good value from it. Gloves is a good treasure, but it's just it's just you don't really get enough value early on. Just not enough value. Got share beard. Gross. Actually, don't mind losing a share bear on turn one. Then you get, especially on Thanos, because then you get free stuff. So, works out okay. Nice, full damage. No real purpose in shrink raying here. I guess we just play it like this. Consideration for buying the egg, but I'm gonna be level three next turn. I think I just hold the chicken and go from there. Nice. Putting some, uh, putting some good damage all around here. I guess we're, I guess we're rocking the chicken for another turn. Fine by me. Was this very, very good hit? <laughs> Solid. Maybe this game will be less, uh, less cursed. Ooh, Dark Contract or Dancing Sword? I think Dark Contract is just a little bit too good on this hero. Ooh. Hope you guys can't hear that static. That was brutal. Got a random static spike in my ear. Oh. Am I sitting on this chicken again? Or am I selling and buying the white? I guess... There's no reason not to buy this. It's a pretty massive unit. No static? Okay, good. On my end. 
Sometimes I think when uh, my phone like does like updates or or something along those lines, it interferes with my my speakers. Like I get my revenge on the share bear. Punch the share bear in the face. And damage. Thanks a lot, Shump. I don't want the mim. I don't want this Princess White though either. The game really wants me to take that mem. I'm not really sure how I want to position here. Could end up being correct to just uh, maybe play it like this. I think I like this. Oh, yeah, this is definitely my last game. Just been such a stressful last couple days. Gonna take it easy. Oh, I snipe my. There's another Fates player with uh, double blind mice. I just don't think that's a very good line. I feel like you bleed out. You should go to the movies. Yeah, fancy, fancy that idea. I have a black cat. I guess I can. Do I really want to go for birds, birds and stuff again? Like, it's just so, so bad. I really hate it. Oh, uh, it's it's got to be correct. A weaver. Uh, Do I even need the... I don't even think I need the Mim, to be honest. Probably get away with... <clears throat> Probably get away with something like this. Sell... Do I sell three and buy Water Wraith here? I think I do. Just I, I what, basically all I'm doing is just trying to keep my keep my tempo going until I can find a better set of units. That's bad. That's very bad. Black cat. I might be okay here. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, just keeping my health total up. I haven't seen a Sporko yet, so it doesn't really make a lot of sense to try to take a Feasting Dragon. Chupacabra is pretty mediocre. I don't know. There, there's a fine line between being too picky and... You know, playing smart, hard to know sometimes. Uh, 
скажем, я... This may end up being another one of those games. I'm to dump. Dump Spell Weaver. Kind of a weird decision, but I think it's correct. The spell Weavers really weren't going to give me the value that I wanted them to. Having double black cat is just way better. Buffs both of my queen and my buzzard considerably. Guaranteed win. So. I'm so strong, I might actually be able to just buy XP here. I almost never want to buy XP on 4, but this is a scenario where I think it's reasonable. I'm gonna do it. That's Sea Terror is literally the perfect unit. That was exactly what I wanted to find. Give me a shot at a level 7 treasure next turn. Not interested in the uh, the other bearded vulture here. We're just uh, yeah, we're we're just kind of riding out the uh, the treasure map, seeing where this takes us. I would consider maybe taking a level six treasure, but I'm so far ahead that it just doesn't really. Doesn't really feel necessary. Keep seeing streamers skip Nian. Yeah, I mean, like, there's obviously scenarios where I could cons I could see like skipping it, but for the most part, like, if you have the if you have the healthy life total, there's no reason not to. Wow, this is disgusting. Duplicator. I got trucked by that reduplicator. Okay, so we're looking for just the typical gang of level 5 units, Oni Kings. There we go. Uh, Yaga's kind of a big commitment. Like, obviously it's a good monster, but... Yeah. I mean these are these are losing their value very very fast. Okay, we got a little bit stronger this turn, but not considerably. Very scary. Just, uh, just wonder waddle things. Gross. You start bleeding out pretty soon. If I, if I keep playing people like this, I'm gonna be bleeding out very fast. I need to get strong quickly. I don't think I want double pig. Double double oni is good. Double pig is getting a little bit greedy. My, all right, I'm gonna take this Dusa. 
level six next turn. No reason to sit around. Don't want the Sporko. I wonder if I, I wonder if I actually just hit it like this. Just take out the Sporko altogether. It's just not really doing much. I'm surprised I haven't found the E-Terror triple. Probably haven't found any triples. I hope this doesn't turn into one of those games where you're just treading water for several turns and then you take too much damage trying to get a comp together. Like, fortunately I found some good units, so I'm not like... But if I keep playing against shit like this, it's getting a little bit scary. I think I'm okay. Yeah, I should be fine here. We got full Oni King value, so we're fine. We killed him. Whew. Spooky. As soon as you fight somebody that has like double upgraded Prince Arthur, it's a little scary. There's my level 7 treasure. Uh, magic sword, probably. I could go for Grail, but I I don't think Grail is the play. I'm playing against the strongest player. If I take magic sword, I'm looking for like Tweedles or to some extent Doom Breath. Obviously, Pumpkin King. Yeah, I'm just gonna take the magic sword. A lot of a lot of good options. Grail dig for piggy bank. The, the copium play. I'm at 21 life. I can I can play the Hercules here. There's the black cat. Oh boy. Alright, let's uh let's see. Let's see if it if it would have happened. <laughs> Your questing units have a higher treasure. Let's go for a level seven again. Yeah, Grail on, on this hero is definitely pretty insane. Another level 7 treasure, why not? Oh no, I mispositioned. Oh no! I didn't realize my Oni was supposed to be in this slot. Hope I don't get punished too bad for that. Shoot this. That bad, I guess. Okay, mirror, 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 mirror with Medusas and shit. Definitely down. Double Grumble is. Oh my God! Hello, triples. Uh. Okay. That was a... <laughs> Pretty silly, right? What was this guy's build? This is the Royal Reduplicator guy. I don't think I care about the triple, right? The triple just doesn't matter to me. I think we're just doing this. Or 
Hercules is just better. A unit now. Pretty likely that I kill him here. Wait, what's in the what's in the box? Yeah, I don't think it matters. Like, wasn't the other play just better, like, not crocking this for them? Like, isn't that just better? Because then you get two Juliets rather than two Romeos. I'm not sure I agree with crocking there. It's kind of a strange play. Okay, so we're looking for, like... Like, Monster Book is okay. It's not really where we want to be. Pumpkin King is obviously, like, sanity. Looking for, like, another Medusa. Two Romeos, two Juliets instead of just two Juliets. I get yeah, I guess that is true. It's slightly better. Kind of whiffed hard on the rest of this. Didn't matter though. Is there an argument for putting something else in slot one? Not really. Oh, what an irritating board. <laughs> Get fucked. What you get for popping me earlier, Wonderwaddle. Payback's a bitch. Could make an evil Herc. I'll pass. Like, I'm looking for like a shard for the Hercules, and I'm looking for another Medusa. My other Medusa. I'd be okay with an apple tree to replace the pigs as well. It's gonna happen though, it looks like. Remember that time that I. Oh, this was the evil. Ooh, I hope they replace their sarcophagus. Sarcophagus is a little spooky against my comp it actually eats my medusas hopefully they don't have it uh yeah you remember that time i picked up the the neon on like four two and i just never oh, no I, that's not true i did see i did see the triple i just passed it but it's not often that you see a, a neon on the bench that just goes completely ignored they didn't replace the sarcophagus which is a little annoying as long as it doesn't ping off my Medusas, I'm fine. Okay, so far so good. That's bad. I'm fairly certain I have a little too much coverage here. Yeah, there's no way. GG. I don't kill him this fight, but I kill him... ...next fight, probably. Yeah, they're, I would say they're just going to concede, yeah. That was a crazy, crazy, crazy game. Hey everyone, thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe to see more. I put out a new video and live stream on Twitch every single weekday. You can also follow me on Twitter, at JohnTheWordsGuy. See you later.